Durham West. Hello. Oh, hello. Yes, uh, am I through to Jehovah's Witnesses? Yes, yes. Oh, hi. I'm on JW.org. That's where I got the number. Find a meeting. <laughs> Hi, um, I'm reading Enjoy Life Forever and doing a lot of work and research on your website. Um, I don't want to disturb you if you're at work at the moment, but maybe somebody could help mm -hmm. sometime. I don't know if you're busy at the moment. I don't want to disturb you if you are. No, I, I, I am at work, but um, what would you like help with specifically? And I'll see if I can arrange something. Um, well, I guess the first thing would be chapter 13 of Enjoy Life Forever. It talks about warfare and politics, religions that shouldn't be involved in warfare and politics. Um, that's the first problem. Okay, and what was your name, sorry? Uh, my name is Robert, Robert Skinner. Thank you. Um, the second one would be chapter 15, paragraph 3. I'll just read it for you. It's confusing. It says, after Jesus's life as a human ended, he was resurrected as a spirit and he returned to heaven. Well, kind of. When I went to church, which was many years ago, it was an evangelical church. It says he was resurrected as a spirit, you see. Okay. Um, but the tomb was empty. And when he resurrected, he showed his disciples the, the marks of crucifixion in his hands and in his feet. I mean, why would he do that if he was risen as a spirit? So, so do you do you live local to Durham? I'm I'm, a, I'm some way to the south of you, um, wow. yeah. but it's difficult to get in contact with Jehovah's Witnesses because no one tends to answer the phone. Oh, right. uh, okay, okay. I guess yeah. they're in the Kingdom Hall buildings. That's probably the reason. <laughs> Yeah, well, you'd be, you'd be more than welcome to, to visit whichever hall is local to I you. I do you not. be able to find. No, sir, I do not. I used to be an evangelical Christian. I no longer attend. Okay. I'm happy okay. to. I, I pray, I read my Bible, but I don't go Excellent. to any religious meetings. I see. Okay. Um, okay. After my experiences as an evangelical Christian. Um, the, the final thing it is rather strange. Um, might seem a little bit silly, but as I've gone on to jw.org and I, I've spent a lot of time there um, I, I've noticed that some of the pictures in the books um, tend to have some sort of when I was a kid you used to get some kiddie magazines and you could fold pages and you know look at a page upside down you find hidden hidden things in the page I'm kind of a bit puzzled because um, Looking at some of you, some of your literature, like the knowledge book, on page one hundred and thirty-two, there's a picture of Jehovah sitting on a throne in heaven. And if you fold the page so you only see the two quarters, the out, the left-hand side quarter, and the right-hand side quarter, and you miss the middle half, um, then you clearly see a, a skull sitting on top of a pyramid. I mean, it's kind of a bit weird. Why? Why would that be there? I, I don't understand it. Okay. Well, uh, well, thank you for getting in touch, Robert. As I said, I, I'm at work, so I, I can't really talk um, yeah. too much. But um, I, I'd encourage you to. The best thing to do would be to, if if you want to discuss these things in person, or uh, it would probably be to visit your uh, local. No, I no, I've, 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 I've saying, already but, told you. Sorry, sir. I've told yeah. you. I do not. Yeah. I left the evangelical church many years okay. ago. I, I I do not attend any church building after what happened to me. Okay. Now, I'm happy to speak on the phone or Zoom. Um, I mean, there's another thing that really puzzled me, and it's one of the songbooks, uh, Sing to Jehovah, published in 2008. I don't know if you're familiar with that book. Yeah. Yeah. On the back cover, the book was reprinted with changes, and I thought, that's odd. And when you look at the back cover of the original book, 2008 edition it's got a black man and a black woman on the black on the back cover at the bottom left hand side and well I'm not going to describe what's in front of the black man but it's not his arm and then following complaints I believe the book was republished and the black man was removed and a white man was inserted and when you look at the picture of the white man you can clearly see his hand is holding the hymn book I'm just kind of shocked. Why? Why is that on the back cover of one of your hymn books? 
I, I don't understand it, you see. Okay. Well, as I said, Robert, I, I'm at work, so I, yeah. can't, I can't really get in touch. But Do you I wanna... appreciate your call. Yeah, you pass um, my details on, yes? And what, what I would suggest is with, with those particular questions, you would be better ringing the head, head office for this I've country. done that. Okay. I've done that. Um, I, that, I, I, that. I wrote to them and they told me, okay. go to jw.org and do some research. Okay. So they fought me off. They, they weren't interested. Okay, well, that, that, would, that would be my suggestion for, for those particular uh, issues. They're not what? things that we, well, the, the points that you've raised that I, I'm not really in a position to talk about because I'm at work. So yeah. Well, you can look at uh, them would, and get back to me, surely. You can look yeah, at them and get back to me. Yeah. I, w I would thank you for your call. And as I said, jw.org. So you're just going to ignore me. You're not, yeah, you're not definitely gonna... the best places to go to. So you're just going to ignore me, is that right? No, I, as I said, I, I'm at work. Will so... you pass my details on, yes or no? If, if you would like me to, yes, I please. can pass you the details that, that, on. That'd be great. I'm slightly to the south of Durham. Thank you very much. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Take Bye. Care.